Hey guys, we made it home from Battle at the Beach about 1.40 this morning. It was a long road to get there, but we had a great time. The night before, we loaded the car onto the trailer about 1.30 in the morning because we had an entire rear end out for the entire week. Getting redone, I shouldn't say the entire week, for the last month. I think we had it out ever since dig or die and i'll show you some videos of why at the end we weren't sure we were going to make it this is us winching it on the trailer because we didn't want to wake the neighbors so at that point we hadn't even cranked the car in more than a month and we're just hoping that everything was good we spent so much time on the rear end and we're just trying to get there so that was just been insane so we the first round of battle at the beach What you see here is a picture of how the truck and the other lane ended that race. So that was a little bit of a wild ride. There's a great video on this gentleman's page right here if you want to go check it out. Next for second round, we pulled our buddies Bad Apple in their green Nova. We have raced them before at Dig or Die. We were not happy to so we Bad Apple beat us there by about a car and a half, as our guesstimate. Um, I hope you watched it on Pennywise Live, like half of the world. But um, it was a crazy, wild night. It wasn't too bad, considering we had never done a no-prep frontside race. We really stick to the backside races. For instance, like Digger Dice. So here's some footage of us going to Stunnerville and practicing before getting some trespasses in before we went to dig or die and that will kind of explain to you exactly what happened and why we had to redo the real This one ended with a win, and uh, that was a super gas fast guy from New Jersey, I want to say. And then second round, we come and see what happens. What you'll see is that this groove was cut into the tire when what we assumed was our rear end moving a little bit. Um, but this is the second And we made it through second round, and then we were heading into third round, and we had to do a quick tire change <laughs> because um, the was cut out. And third round, we're going against uh, the And he outran us in that third round. But man, we had a great time. And our son um, started tuning the car for us. And so that was his tunes all weekend. So that was amazing. Just like Battle at the Beach, we were um, trying to figure out exactly what to do because we've never done 
a front side no prep, which if you know anything about it, it is completely different than backside no prep. So we definitely learned a few things that we'll learn on the next one if we so desire to go to one. But Clifton put on a great race. Sorry that it's been so long in between videos, but this is the reason why. Right after dig or die, our daughter got married. It was literally like a week later, and we were just hardcore into the wedding planning. And the mom and me cannot um, talk to you about it without showing you our amazing pictures, which most of them were taken by, of course, our Bella Visions that goes to the drag. Look how talented she is that she goes and takes <laughs> all these amazing pictures as well. Managed to capture some of her in them. And uh, we had a great night. In the midst of all that, my mother had a stroke. So we have been busy, but thank you for watching and subscribing.